Hey, what's going on? Um, I will play you just a little bit of this one, and I will teach to you right after. So. Gotta keep your head up, oh, oh. Keep your legs ahead up, hey, yeah, yeah. Keyboard here out on the fifth fret, and I'll teach it from the capo um, using minimal movement chords. So here's how I'm doing the chords. These guys are on the third fret relative to the capo, first and second string. Um, good. First one's an A minor. This guy is on the second fret, fourth string. Good. It's an A minor, kind of works well for an A minor. Um, G like this. This guy's on the third fret. Second string, uh, third fret, sixth string, second fret, fifth string there for my G. E minor like so. These guys on the second fret, fifth string, and fourth string. D like so. This guy is on the third string, second fret. So sometimes I'll do it like that. That's a D sus4. And sometimes I'll take the pinky off and put my middle finger down there on the first string, second fret. It's my D. Either way, um, we'll also need a C. So it's just one down from a G. G's right there. C add nine, plot a C. This guy is on third fret, fifth string. Second fret, um, fourth string there. Shooting for hitting five. Um, and last one's a B minor. Kind of easy way to get to a B minor. These guys are on the second fret, fifth string, and third string. B minor shooting for hitting five again there. Good, those are the chords I need. Um, uh, the strum pattern I'm working with is kind of like down, 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 down,
maneira pode oh, E que maneira dela é de ver A queima do pão de pão Queima Remember some things huh? Que queima maneira pode oh, oh, E que maneira é de ver Queima Tudo em um rainbow de Tudo em um sing and call out those chords along the way. So anyway, pretty catchy song. I like the video too. If you haven't seen the video, you should check it out. Um, it has that, that guy from The Office, uh, Dwight, in it. What's his name? Like Rain something. Uh, so anyway, cool song. I hope that was kind of helpful. Um, not too bad. The strumming is a, a little bit tricky and with the chord changes, they move kind of fast, but I think if you work on it, you'll be able to get it. So um, yeah, thanks for watching. See you.